Some families at Green Meadow Cemetery on Shanks Lane say they're furious after learning mementos placed on their loved ones' grave sites were thrown away. Rose Smith says a garden stone placed at her son's burial site was removed. And although she's disappointed it's gone, she received phone calls from people she says were more affected than she was. Most of them did not have headstones. They used uh, uh, the things they put out there as, uh, as a monument, as a place to be able to know where their loved one is. Green Meadows Cemetery says they have had a policy for years that nothing is permitted on the ground and everything must be on the headstone or monument. Artificial flowers are allowed in the winter and during mowing season, flowers must be put in vases. But families say they weren't aware of the policy. Councilwoman Tammy Hawkins says communication needs to be better. They just do not have the manpower as of now to contact everybody. You know, uh, but 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 I beg to differ a little bit. You find the um, the manpower and the time to take people's money. You have to find that same time to reach out to people about their loved ones. Terry Watkins, who manages the cemetery, says they're working to get more signs up so everyone knows the rules. My other employees, they also have family members buried out here. So I, I want to apologize to the families, but it's a myth if you think we do not care. That's not true. For Smith, she hopes the cemetery will have more compassion in the future. When you come in and your loved one's item has been discarded as trash, that's trauma all over again. Jamie Mace, WLKY News.